on the cover of Vogue is pretty much every girl's dream. But when you do make it, you want to make sure it represents the best of you. Being Vogue, of course you expect it to be photographed by talented photographers who can do their magic and do you justice. However, when you're the vice president of US, it isn't just about looking good. It's also about making sure the message you give to the world around you is a good one. On Sunday, 10 January, Vogue released the cover of the February 2021 issue of their magazine, featuring Vice President-elect Kamala Harris. However, the image they chose to portray her received mixed messages. Here is what happened. US Vogue issued a picture of Vice President-elect Kamala Harris wearing a casual brown suit and converse in front of pink satin drapes against a green wall. The picture was shot by lensman Tyler Mitchell who was the first African-American photographer to land a Vogue cover when he photographed Beyonce for US Vogue in August 2018. So of course the world expected it to be a good one. It is claimed that a lot of thought went into how best to represent Harris. The background was supposedly chosen to represent the colours of her sorority at Howard University and the converses were supposed to mark her love of sneakers on campaign trails. The casualness of the image was coupled with the words by the people for the people. Another picture of Kamala was also released by the magazine later. In this picture, Harris looks more formal in a powder blue suit and is standing in front of gold table with golden curtains. In this picture, Kamala Kamala appears to be more powerful which is further brought to light with the words Madam Vice President Kamala Harris and the New America. It has been revealed according to CNN that this was a picture which had been agreed and signed off by Kamala as a cover. Many social media critics are outraged that Vogue opted to use a more casual picture to represent the Vice President, calling it amateurish and disrespectful, while pointing out that the celebrities get more attention. One Twitter user explained why it was considered disrespectful writing. Folks who don't get why the Vogue cover of VP elect Kamala Harris is bad are missing the point. The pick itself isn't terrible as a pick. It's just far, far below the standards of Vogue. They didn't put thought into it like homework finished the morning is due. Disrespectful. One user responded, I think it's a photo designed to convey a strong message about whom she is. Look at the pink satin contrasting with the casual down-to-earth outfit with the funky shoes. And then the slogan, by the people for the people, it conveys everything Kamala Harris is. I love it. Many users felt that the gold picture should have been the cover. One user wrote, the light blue suit is far more flattering and respectful. A Vogue spokeswoman defended the choice telling WWD the team at Vogue loved the images Tyler Mitchell shot and felt the more informal image captured Vice President-elect Harris's authentic, approachable nature. To respond to the seriousness of this moment in history and the role she has to play leading our country forwards by celebrating both images of her as covers digitally, the spokeswoman said. Whether you think the picture does her justice or not, Kamala certainly looks good at both, but we would be keen to hear your thoughts of the cover. Did Vogue miss a mark? Was it too rushed? And does it do her justice? Thanks for watching. Have it all daily. Please like, share and subscribe and check out our website for more.